Today I'm going to show you how to make your own cookie scribe. We use cookie scribes when we're using the royal icing on sugar cookies to move the icing around to the edges, to fill little spots, and also certain designs that require swirling and popping air bubbles. It's basically just a stick with a pointy end on it that helps to move things around. This is one example of what we're going to be doing. It's very, very simple. All we start with is some turkey or poultry lacers, some silicone beads. These silicone beads are marketed as baby teething beads. They're BPA free, safe to use, and very easy to wash. And then we have little rubber earring backs. Those are used to keep the beads onto the lacers. So you'll just take a lacer and start layering the beads in whatever design you want. This particular one I'm showing you is going from biggest to smallest with using the smallest beads as spacers, but you can do it however you want. Let me put two in. Once you get the ones on the end, you're going to take the earring back, just kind of finesse that on the end. And then just push it down with your nails. They're a little bit harder because those holes are smaller. And then your scribe is all ready. If you want to take a second earring back, you can put that right on the end. So when you're storing your scribe, you're not going to poke yourself with it. If you prefer just to have all the same size, that's totally fine as well. You can just layer those on there in all the same size. Basically, it just helps you to get a nice grip on the cookie scribe so you don't go losing it. We'll put one more here on the end. And then just take that earring back. Just like that. And you're all set to decorate cookies.